Hello everybody and welcome back to Chill Out Weekend. I hope everybody's having a great weekend and chilling out. Uh, we're on a big island. And uh, I found this island and I moved over here, brought some stuff with me. And I got all my gear from my other series, Wrecked. Uh, but let me show you the island to begin with. There's a little bit of an island over here I didn't uncover. But this is a big island. This is the biggest island I've been on in a long time. And of course you can see there's some frozen areas around. And uh, I've already started the layout of my keep. And I'll show you that here in a minute. Uh, and like I said, I didn't even change uh, gear uh, from my other series. Normally I uh, switch it up, you know. And uh, But I found a um, portal and it had uh, a, a gold shovel and this copper shovel. And they both had silk touch. And I broke the silk touch getting the... Uh, the blocks here grass blocks um, and I've been trying to lay them out here on the ground to get some grass started uh, I got this filled in in here finally and I got my bed and uh, I went with blue instead of gray because hey it's chill uh, anyway and I brought some materials over like I said uh, some cobblestone and, and uh, stuff and so I've got some cobble and some more dirt here. And then I've got uh, all the saplings in here. I brought 10 of all the ones I had. And then I found some more cherry saplings. Um, so I only got six of those because those drop a lot of saplings. So I'm okay with that. I brought some extra barrels with me. And then I've got my uh, potatoes, carrots, some wheat seeds, some pumpkin seeds, and some melon seeds. Uh, so, yeah. Yep. And uh, I brought an anvil uh, with me and uh, a furnace. And what I didn't bring was a uh, crafting bench. Oh, I just used silk touch on that. Mycelium. I didn't need to do that. I need to put that away. Uh, but I only have enough to make a crafting bench here. And then I've got to plant some uh, stuff. Let me sleep. So I just took a regular mushroom and uh, put some dirt around it. I had some other spruce with me, logs, and so I put those there uh, just to make a starter hut. And then I used this as the central center of the build here. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and Put the silk touch in or silk stuff in here. I don't have any more things. I've got plenty of almost broken tools. I brought an extra bed because I was going to bring a villager and I forgot all about it. So here we are chilling out. So let me finish carving this out. So basically I laid out a square and then I laid out the four squares on the corners. Uh, there we go. And uh, then we've got these walls in between. So 
setting up the foundation. I'm leaving that one there from now, the one with the torch on it. There we go. And uh, I actually thought about doing this in creative mode, you know, just to super chill it. Um, but now, because I usually die in, well, not die in creative mode, but I do die, but mostly from falling off of high spaces. But there we go. And then again, we'll take a look at it from bird's eye view. Here we go. I got to fill in the dirt on this side and this side. And a little bit on this side, I think. Um, but, yeah. We don't have enough dirt to go around right now. Well, I might have enough to go around this part. <laughs> but, yeah. We'll do some filling in. Uh, but I'm not sure where I want to go. I think I want to come over here and uh, make some kind of thing or maybe just use this. that use the corner, in other words, of my build. Put in a marker. Let's put this here for, as a marker so that we make sure we don't go further than we're supposed to. Uh, in other words, I want to stay within the, the square, if you will. Uh, here. Fill this in as much as possible. Yeah, I'm liking it. And uh, we've got to get where we can get some more tools, but I gotta remember that I've got to plant the uh, stuff. We gotta go plant the trees. And I was just thinking about it. And uh, I'm gonna take my saplings here. And uh, see here, oak, spruce, birch, jungle, acacia, and then I brought 12 dark oaks because they have to plant them four by four, and then we've got our cherry. Uh, and what I was thinking is we want to beautify this whole valley but or this whole island but I want to try to keep as many of the natural mushrooms as possible okay and uh, so what I want to do is I think I want to plant my trees around, but I want to, um, to do them in different coordinates. And I notice there's a tree over here, and I got a feeling that that's an acacia, uh, which indicates a, am I going in the right direction? 
which indicates a lush cave, maybe. So let's go look in this direction. Um, so what I want to do, see there's that tree there. Let's plant some oaks right along here. That takes care of our oaks. And then over here, we'll plant our birch. There we go. And there's that acacia tree that I'm talking about right there. And if you dig down below this, you come into a uh, lush cave. So we might go in that direction. All right, let's plant our dark oaks up here. There we go. Put a torch here. One here. And I don't know if I'm going to be keeping these little mushrooms around, but for now we'll do it. And then uh, let's go ahead and uh, finish planting these trees I know it's dark and I'm out here in the dark but I'm not scared. Okay, and here is our spruce. Now, I do want to plant some jungle, and I want to plant them in a four by four, so like that. Another one over here. And then I'll plant a couple of separate ones uh, that are single. Like that. All right. And now, where are my cherry trees? got cherry trees I got two more spruces I'll hold on to those uh, cherry tree we'll put up here how about this come up here and we'll plant these in four by four as well well just one but I just remembered we don't have enough to do that there we go. So now the only one, only trees that we don't have sorted out are the acacia. And I don't even know if they'll really grow here. But we'll figure it out. planting them kind of on the zigzag because they kind of grow that way and 
I'm going to do the two block maneuver here. Put a torch on it. See, we got rooted dirt. I'm kind of doing this so I don't fall to my death. Uh, but I'm kind of standing in the middle of the two blocks. And I just realized something. And that is how you're going to get back out of here, Barry. Still got rooted dirt though. So, do I have another pick? Almost broken one. Can we discover the lush cave? Four. We get down too far. We're already down to 46. There goes our pick yet again. And guess who doesn't have a crafting bench, wood, or anything? get out of here what size my torch is on okay so we'll go up the cobble and uh, cover this up <laughs> so we're not getting rained on vein mine is but then I would fall to my death so I don't want to do that as long as I'm hitting cobble I know I'm safe okay here we go Torches are down. Come on. Can I cheat and look at the mini map underground? See if it's showing anything? I hope the mod that I have mods I have in didn't mess this up and make it so that this isn't do doesn't do what it normally does in regular vanilla Minecraft. Silver ore. Getting dark, I understand. Oh, I left that silver ore up there, didn't I? Whoops. vein mine on a regular block. Lead. Oh, there's a diamond. So let's get that. Make sure we're back in our regular spot. some more silver some copper I can get behind that because I can make more tools let's put the dirt in 
so that we can put the torches on, collect the uh, stuff. We're going to get there, folks. We're going to get there. I might have to edit down quite a bit, but... can we go? We're already down to Y16, dudes. Oh, well, okay then. If you don't know what Y16 is, that's where iron is found. And some clay. Let's dig out in this direction. I'm going to keep going down. But I'm going to have to go get some stuff for ladders, etc. silver okay let's let's do it I, I know I said it was cheaty but let's look at uh, the mini map and see if we can get a sense of where we are. Now see there's a huge lush cave over here and then it looks like a, a mine shaft but are we anywhere near a lush cave? Hard to say. All right. We got to go down to negative. If we get all the way down to negative 54, which is diamond level, then we know we don't have a lush cave. <laughs> and again, that might be the mod is doing that. In other words, they just planted an acacia tree on the island and there is no lush cave under it, which would be a total and complete ripoff. All right, we're in deep slate, folks. We're down at Y level zero. I'm having my doubts. But we can also get use this material for building. So, oh, there's some moss. Yep. Okay. This should be should be some lush cave stuff. Uh, Not seeing any lush cave stuff. Deep slate iron. Yes, please. One piece? Really? Oh, here's some lush cave. See, there's moss right above my head here. And some glowberries. So it's a very little lush cave alright let me vein mine this out oh, ok maybe not I'm going to let you guys go after we get this 
iron here. And uh, let's see, get a furnace going so we can smelt some of this stuff. Some iron. I forgot about the iron, so let's go ahead and just make a pick with that. Oh. Don't burn all your sticks, Gray. see how low can we go the answer is pretty low oh yeah why minus 32 so we're almost diamond level. Uh oh, I'm out of torches. And this is going to keep going. Bree, you might want to eat something. I'm trying to get down there by that lava. Just to see how low we are. Okay, we're at negative 54. Guess what negative 54 is, folks? This is our diamond level. And my server is about ready to shut off, so I'm going to let you guys go for another chill weekend. Thank you for stopping by and checking me out. I do appreciate it and uh, consider subscribing what I was saying is consider subscribing and uh, we'll see you again next time check out my weekly series wrecked take care